The final design for the Mexico Sports Center was unveiled this morning at the Marion Jones Sporting Complex. The construction of the multi-purpose indoors facility is the second component of a comprehensive infrastructure cooperation project for Belize. The training complex will be built at a cost of five million U.S. dollars to be drawn from the Yucatan Fund. The Yucatan Fund for infrastructure, infrastructure has been uh, working for bilateral cooperation, and we just were able to come here thanks to one of the first projects, which was in 2012, the road that allowed the Chak Temal Bridge between our two countries to function. So thanks to that project, we were able to come here on time. And uh, other than, 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 than this wonderful sports center, which of course you know that young people are formed not only intellectually, but also with their minds and bodies. And that's why sports is so important for youth. But the other project that we're going to, to develop is a project of a school in Toledo, an intercultural school for Belizeans that speak Mayan and English. And for us, it's a great privilege to be able also to build that school. Both initiatives are being undertaken by the Mexican Agency for International Development Corporation, AMEXID. Building these recreational facilities fosters social integration and economic development. The contractor is a joint venture, so we have Maellas, which is a lead contractor from Belize, a local, a local contractor, and Grupo ITEM de, um, of Guatemala, okay, that will produce the steel structures. Uh, the total amount of the work is about 2.8 million and we recently signed, so in December 2017, we signed uh, the project. So we should complete the project in um, a little bit more than one year, so in 15 months. So by the, this time next year, the, the project should be ready and available for you guys. Uh, Regarding the structure, basically we have two courts, one for basketball and one for volleyball. Uh, but this can be doubled thanks to telescopic uh, bleachers and we can get two courts for basketball and two for volleyball. So we can have uh, up to 14 training at the same time, which is quite huge, so it would be a nice structure. CEO Adele Katsim of the Ministry of Sports and Culture spoke of the mental picture for sports in the country. That inspiration, she says, comes from Mexico. This new vision for sports in Belize is in part inspired by the role of sports and recreation that we see in Mexico. I can recall the early discussions that we had which resulted in this project being developed. It was in the discussions that were undertaken between the Volleyball Association, the Basketball Association, the Ministry Responsible for Sports, and other civil society organizations in Belize that this project was birthed. I'm very happy that it came to fruition and that the government of Mexico saw the importance of meeting our priorities um, for community development. Reporting for News 5, I am Isana Cayetano.